guys O'Day from Hot Tips and I'm going to show you how to put Gingerbread Android 2.3.2 .2 onto your HD2. As you see I'm on Windows Mobile, the horrible thing. This is a custom copy but Windows still sucks either way for the HD2. So what you're going to do is you're going to have to turn off the phone. Okay, make sure you follow the steps on how to have your HD2 accept custom ROMs and software and all that, which I'll put the link into the thread. So you're going to first put in bootloader after you've done the previous steps from the link I'm going to put up. So to do that, you're going to hold the volume down button and the power button together. And then you're going to see this beautiful screen. So that's a bootloader. Plug the cable in. Then it's going to say USB. Onto your computer, open up Mag Loader. Go to ROM Update Utility. Sorry, it's not clear, but I'm recording it from my phone. Then just agree. Wait, make sure your phone is charged. And then. After you agree, whatever, just hit update and next. This literally takes like two seconds, as you're going to see right now. Okay. Well, your phone says HTC, but yeah, you see how fast it just flew. And all these files, I'm going to link it up anyways. So just download them and you're good to go. Just press finish. Your phone's gonna boot up. So now you're gonna get this uh, option. Well, a lot of options from Mag Loader. You're gonna scroll down to USB flasher by pressing the volume down button. So this Mag Loader version 1.13, this can be number five. So just press the call button. It's going to put in USB mode. It's going to say wait for USB and USB. But you can't really see it, but, you know. So I'm going to link up the gingerbread. And there's going to be a file called the run. Just double click it. You can see the screen come up. Click next. Click next again. And then just wait on the phone. It's really simple. It should take you no more than 15 minutes after you download all the files. And this is called NAND ROM. It overwrites Windows and just installs it on the NAND. I'm just going to pause the video and I'll come back. Alright, so it's almost done. And then it's going to reboot. Yeah, the first uh, boot up, it's going to take a while, about a minute and a half, so what's on the first boot up? So after it boots up, what I recommend doing is rebooting it again, so it restarts, then it runs a lot better. As you see, it's dragging what's normal on the first boot up. But yeah, I'm just going to pause it again. You can see the X. It's the Nexus S software, Gingerbread 2.3.2. .2. I'm going to pause after it loads. Well, pause it until it loads. So it should be, almost be done. There we go. 
Now you're on the gingerbread 2.3.2. There you go. Enjoy it. Remember the first boot up, it's a little bit laggy. Just reboot it. If you have any questions, just go um, join our Facebook page and just ask me there directly. I can help you out easier. There you go. There you have it. So just if you need any help, I'd recommend just joining our Facebook fan page. Ask the questions there and I can respond easily. Thank you and have a great day.